Buzzwool locked in. So you've been talking about this Pokemon quite a bit. You have today. a Buzzwool. Okay, a that's unexpected. Buzzwool into Trevenant. Okay, OG, gonna see how that does. It's the first Buzzwool we see after the nerfs. Yeah, I, like I don't know what to the, expect. The about Buzz Wolves, they can continue yeah, Buzzwool late game is non-existent uh, now. It's super, super bad. Well, but, uh, this it's early game, doesn't get changed. This early game is still good. Mm. Uh, but it's late game is so pathetic now. I mean, I not mean, pathetic, but it's just hard to close our games. You just can't do superpowers make on superpower anymore. You have too much delay in between. A lot of work cut out for the Eldegoss of Poor egg noob. Got the early uh, Eevee gangs. With OG, gonna shred down some wild Pokemon. Wow. Trying to get to that level five. One of the best power spikes in the entire game is Buzzwool at five. Yeah, I really like what Paragon did with the Mew so instead of the Eevees job, for the top to five rotation. It's even stronger, maybe, actually. Like, I feel like the coaching Electro Ball Mew is much quickly. scarier than like a Mystic uh, Fire Savion for top. Maybe in time for the 850 mark, but right now we're already just getting such high EXP. XP for OG on that buzz wall. We just need a little bit more XP to get that to level five. Yeah, big clash on the top half, but on the bottom side, just slash versus. Yeah, we got an attack at what's top again? I leave you on, I guess. A of but the fight is on top, like, like out well spectator. Where do you think? So, first, has to run all the way in a high where, guys, where do you think the action is gonna happen? In the one v two lane with the slow bro, or in the four v three lane? Where do you think the action is gonna happen? I guess in the slow bro alone lane. Uh, okay, right OG is very fight already, though, but I mean, I still hate, I hate seeing Mimikyu uh, top lane too, so. Oh my god, okay, I mean, that's the Buzzwall early right game, right? That is, uh, yeah. And they get Mimikyu too? Mimikyu speeding away? Eject button? Okay, OG! OG! But if this happens, if you, uh, yeah, I mean, you can still snowball games very hard. And that poor Mimikyu held to just level if you can bid a lead, then Buzzwell can still be very broken. It just depends yet. on, like, Having if you make one mistake, if the comic experience, the game gets close, it becomes difficult, but otherwise, yeah. I would actually assume that maybe all the stacks are in. Uh, they're, they're kind of playing like they, they now have he's a good amount of stacks because they've had a lot of space that they've been I think built. lunch should maybe uh, be tried yeah, a bit more often. Really I think it's actually quite good. For the vision. They're just kind of chilling and saying, yeah, you know what? It's okay. Uh, I'm just going to I'm gonna play this solo top. As we're, it, the, Usually when we see this, I feel like the, the entire team rotates bottom. Just wish exactly the dash, dash would be maybe a bit like the uh, jump would be a bit yeah, further. It's just the only problem with it, right? A piece like it's very low or like low range of a jump. Okay, both teams are zerg down the other lane. Not wanting to fight. Oh, we found a smack from Super Power 2 and Tillion. And Tillion and then we flux down. Cameraman. Cameraman. Like, where are we? What are we looking at? There's a bus with one before the enemy team. I think the cameraman looks tired. We have a bus with smacking down Tillion into the flux down, fighting one against four, and we're looking at. They did get the Reggie Leggy though, and it will land in that tier one goal zone, shattering it, breaking it, but only at a point score of 91. So a very minimal overdunk on the top side. Yeah, and that was intentional by G. They had the opportunity mm -hmm. to stop it, and they immediately just rather than stop it, they got in position for the spawns. The Indeedy spawns. Ooh, and slash so slow bros and killer bit. Like, yeah, we want this to happen. We do not mind losing this. We already have a score. Could be on purpose? Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's on purpose. Leckies, but we're gonna get a big overdunk on that tier one eventually. It could be. We just want oh, the, the snipe shot from downtown, nice but Leafion, one more, Solar Blade. Huge. 40 points in two. And I mean, G's definitely the fav big favorite to win this, right? Oh, it's not even... Yeah. If G wins this one, they are first in the group, so they're going to start a winner bracket at NAIC. So that would be a huge win right here. Oh, the Smackdown Eject button. Oh, Oh, G styling now. Uh, not to say that it was like bad play, but it just got shut down, and that was. The not sure that was needed, but it looked cool. Always. It's he's low level 11 already. I mean, if you get this far ahead on Buzzwall, I guess it's still a great Pokemon, right? Really 
When is an AIC? I actually don't know. Somewhere in June, I think, right? I think it's in June. Okay, maybe it's the. Uh, I don't know. It's someone's fault. But I don't. Yeah, I don't. We don't know if it's the director's fault or the cameraman's fault. I mean, there's different cam. There's multiple people spectating, right? Yeah, but yeah. This is gonna be a really interesting like. Maybe, I mean, all the rest of the team fights basically from here on out. Might just Especially be the director's the sword. Fight, uh, there's so many Someone is doing something wrong. That's that all that matters. Really <laughs> yeah. right? you target it's fine. We can, we can look for that, right? The slow beam. You solo I can't, but we can look for that. The right time. You solo target exactly what you want with the mimic you. There's just a lot there's of... There's so fighting experience. Big, like, big AOE Hydro Typhoon type moves. It's a lot of... Oh, okay. Specific targets at specific times. And this is why you always play Jack button on slow, bro. But he does go down for it, too. But it doesn't really matter. They're going to just run over this fight. Oh, wait, they're actually getting some KOs, though. I only won, actually. I thought Mimikyu would still get one. Oh, gee. That's actually going to be an ace. Oh, Glaceon is still back. Oh, this could be, this could be coming experience right here. No, the Smackdown's going to connect. Oh, gee, is still just murdering them. I guess I Basfo needs more nerfs, right? <laughs> I guess Bus one needs one else. On it, in our game number one. Uh, this is uh, this is looking really good for a GG. It is what it is. But the big thing is that they do have. It's not that their, their team doesn't scale well, but their team doesn't super scale. Uh, and the biggest fear here is. Yeah, it's currently the lowest win rate Pokemon the entire game. From the Glaceon and the entire. The win rate of Smackdown superpower is like 43 percent or something, right? Uh, they do need to catch up. Or 45. And there is an opportunity that G just continues to shut them down. It's by far the lowest win rate, right now, like meta bid. There is going to be a counter engage, but. Oh, there could be a good fight right here. Nice wood hammer. They got one. On the Eldegoss, not the they have to make a push for this goal uh, very badly. Okay, that's huge. Target, would have liked to KO one of the level I don't know how G allows this to happen, though. Still, when they're, they're this is not minutes ahead. I mean, they got the Reggie, at least. Oh, G is here. He's level 14. Well, but nice response from Zella as they have oh, the Emerald 2 stuff to deal a ton of early damage. And Smackdown. Super power, I mean. Yeah. He's just running over the game. It has a 44.6 win rate right now. Super power Smackdown. 44.6 percent. <laughs> And this is truly looking like an ultra beast Jeez. here on Thea Sky Ruins. It is. There's a great opportunity for them to take the 44.6%. So that is brutal. Here. They can even maybe delay it if they want to. Uh, there is going to be a little bit of a the chance. The is just, uh, yeah, he's just losing cruising over this tournament uh, game. See this Regilecki is basically already gone. They're not going to waste too much time. 2 minutes 30 seconds still an amazing time to take Regilecki. A dominating bus boy. They're going to have to deal with that for a while. It's going to really stop them from getting as much as they want to. Catching up to the late game. But Umbra Volvium has done a good job of staying relatively close in the points department yeah. their levels are not terrible they just don't have a level 14. yeah it's just some great counter pushes by umber volpium it's one of the big things that are holding them in this game still glaceon and inteleon are both at level 13 but yeah level 15 boss was going to be terrifying they do not have that crazy infinite combo ever since the most recent nerfs to buzz but still let's see can buzz close up the game i mean this entire team is very far ahead but slam unite in the final moment it's a difficult team fight play. well if you one shot somebody it's G's late game is not that great. They only have a 24 point lead somehow. Right. <laughs> they only have 24 point leads after stomping this entire game. Actually quite wired. Ooh, Lifion. Tried to get the initiation, but the counter engage from oh, slow the reject button. Glaceon gone. On the Glaceon. Where's Passwell? Are oh, there he is? Yeah, we'd already seen the a zero the gauge superpower, but it doesn't matter. His team is cleaning up. So now with both of them down, Riker and the Blissey are gone. We have Luke Hero trying to reset the base. They are on a sliver of HP, so they immediately okay. need to retreat. Trevor to the next one down, and G may have lost one member, but they have absolutely destroyed every other member of Umbra Volpium. Oh, Luke Hero is still up in this fight, but Rayquaza not Wait. even being damaged. They can't think about trying this to steal that major objective. G did go for a bit of a back half, but shut down. 
this is United. A got one v one by Hedegoss. It's twenty four points. And Trevor and some are clutched on bot lane. But it's exactly 24 points though. It would not be enough to win. Okay. Alright. But only a 24 point win seems kind of wild for how like one side of this game played. The G starting on three EVs and last pick Gyarados. That looks pretty scary. Gyarados also gets in some engage. Very strong early game. Bifion, Sylveon, Umbreon. What could be good last pick here? Venusaur. Okay, they go for double snipe. I don't know. If... Hmm. I like Venusaur here. I'm not sure if I do. Maybe. I mean, Umbra Volpium's comp just looks solid too. G's comp is Nothing too wired, but yeah. But the G's comp is uh, scary to look at. Does Mystic of Fire make more sense here? Uh, probably, honestly. Maybe. Umbra doesn't have the greatest early game, so I worry for them. I know there's a Magic Cup, but Magic Cup evolves so early now. I really can't consider Gyarados like a bad early game Pokemon anymore. I get to Gyarados so, so fast. Okay, it was Oh, wait, they might already get. Oh, he got an assist. Yeah. <laughs> Gyarados got an assist. Already more than half. He's almost removed already. Yeah. That is rough. That is rough. Yeah, no, tomorrow's uh, uh, Europe. A good head start for to the tomorrow's top right, 8 in Europe so only. Pokemon were knocked out, the and Skeletor. However, it looks like it's not a I'm not even sure every game tomorrow, but maybe. Oh my god, uh, this, is, is this game is going to snowball so hard. Yeah. Oh, this game is gonna snowball so fast. Actually, the hyper voice. I've been talking about purple a lot. Are you also choosing purple? purple yeah. All right, it's my favorite color, so we will see. Egoist having to fend against multiple targets, but they're still stuck on poor, cute, adorable little Torchic. Not an easy fight for this player. Leafy on trying to dunk the game. Oh, oh. Fully destroy that starter Pokemon for Gen 3 with a solo blade. Yeah, guys, chill, man. Come on, they, they be a bit nice, right okay? Now. Purple side, 50.8%. Wow. 1%. Oh, that's actually uh, that's less balanced. than I thought it was going to be. That is pretty yeah. balanced, yeah. 50.8 is pretty good. I am very impressed. <laughs> so, uh, well, there you go. Choose purple side, people. Give you that slight advantage. Okay, slash, slash shit. Now we'll play Umbreon to try to hit a couple of targets. Pull oh, of my. It works out perfectly. Am I allowed to stream Jeez. this? Oh, yeah, yeah. Charles is also in danger. They hit the level five, though. They hit that second tier goal zone, which gives a ton yeah, more you... shielding than a tier one goal zone. three evolutions, right? You're up against. Of the I mean, barely. I did say the early game is pretty, uh, bottom tier one. pretty strong. <laughs> first Reggie spawns. Yeah. Look at this. I mean, such a gigantic lead in every aspect from G. There's plan. This is one HP again. Blaziken is one HP. Blaziken is down. He's level nine. Tied with their other He's level nine. nine. Level nine Gyarados on level nine Leafy. Those are two of literally the strongest Pokemon in the entire game, and they are both running away with things. Uh, they can easily not send everybody a single direction and win both of these objectives. Yeah, but uh, Eevee's fall of late game, game, right? I mean, they kind of really really do really sometimes like a bit at least, except for Glaceon and. Yes, I mean. Reggie, they've got a chance yeah, to, especially if they potentially have Solar Blade. Yeah, oh yeah, great secure option within that Solar Blade. They're gonna push, I mean, they can't defend this. It's Pedidence too. 
quite a bit into Gyarados. Fight's still kind of raging on on the top side. I mean, Reggie, who's at full? Zone, Everyone is at full. Really what is this production so sometimes? The goals are going to rain in into that tier number two. <laughs> the camera's already up there as again, too. As they possibly can. They are running both the attack weight and the AO so Like, what is this observing again? In their scoring strategy. <laughs> the Sony boy might be one of the biggest storms we ever see in a long time. Uh, they are at least very, very close. 286 now, points already in four yeah, minutes. Yeah, uh, but we also saw... Well, that was weird. Uh, we saw nobody take the red I mean, it's pended... But they did take the tier one goals. Though, nah, so this is... Just oh, wow. Double KO in one solar play. G! Oh, that's why they're called G's, because I watch them, they go G! G! Yeah, exactly. KO streak at 3 too as well. Zillit not quite done. Slash denying the quadra. How to snowball a game. Fantastic look for G. Oh, Zillit has been playing so well. I have to admit, their Leafion is an unbelievable pick. I can't believe how much they're getting it. That's criminal. Three um, goals down. Phase, but I will say, their age Only one goal left. Probably my favorite thing that we got to see today. That was so <laughs> yeah. cool. Uh, but that's all right. The Leafion doing so well for G today. All right, this is the first opportunity for maybe Unrevolpium to get some sort of pick. I mean, uh, Umbreon is obviously going to be quite difficult to deal with, but right now they're just spacing out so they can get oh. that Reggie, and now everybody else is going to come in. We're finally going to get some KOs. It was the defender and the support on G, but I mean, how many Pokemon are you paying with four of those double KOs on not the highest level Pokemon? Uh, the answer, I guess, is four. Look, oh, no, almost five. That was pretty, pretty close there. Pretty scary. Hey, what are we they're supposed to say? Well, we're going to have OG just what trying to even say about this area, doing a great job of it i like that weird surrender and go next i don't know clearly charging one guys he's still rekvaza don't worry rekvaza exists the okay the just wait he's able to dodge back towards the rekvaza right now reggie alecki is going to be on the business end of this is getting absolutely but they're going to push this in i feel like they're going to they're go for it they're going to send it Away the Come on, just push in the main base. Just do it. Do it for content. Going in G's favor. One Reggie Rock for them and a bunch of Reggie Leckies and. <sighs> Only one goal zone left. Oh, Ergos. This is for without a doubt. Okay, they're gonna destroy the last goal on bot lane. All weekend, and some of the most dominant six minutes. All four goals down. Recently, uh, I mean that's. Yeah, I mean I agree. Give us, show us nothing, man. This is not broadcastable. Around winning early, it's too brutal, I agree. The way through. They did a similar idea with all the evolutions in the previous game, and it's just yeah, the goal is still alive, though. They're able to defend it. Uh, I mean, you know, Buzzwall, like I said, I've been I've been saying it's great, but Gyarados is Gyarados. That way, in that top three, the inner we make it bounce, and there it is. Make it right bounce. There. This kind of self initiation is ridiculous. Not only do you get the bounce, you get the unite, everything that you we'll can make do it there, bounce. Add one to CC while doing infinite damage, and when you get KOs, it's got its passive. Gyarados is and we're down. I'm going to be honest, this feels like the dark side of targeted bands like Umbra Volpium is bringing to the mm -hmm. table, especially on orange side. If you're going to be hardcore focusing on specific players or trying to be creative in that aspect, it opens you up to the opportunity of G just picking the really good meta stuff on the other side. And that's why we're seeing Gyarados, Leafeon, Umbreon on these other options. I wonder if Gyarados will be nerfed. I mean, Gyarados should be nerfed, yeah. It was a very late pick for G. At least nerf Gyarados Unite move, I feel like. Their gameplay is to, to match. That's too strong. We're almost at 400 points before the three minute marks happen. Yeah, I do gotta say, I think a lot of the teams that uh, we've actually seen a few today that go for the very Unite move is a bit too strong. The problem is if you're going for a lot of targeted picks, there's so many good Pokemon right now that you have to be willing to instant pick those other top Pokemon. Yeah. And so, for example, they they first picked Blissey, right? It's like, yeah, Blissey's very important, but you maybe should have first picked a, a, a Leafeon or, or Gyarados or Umbreon. Like, you can't let first pick have all of those or Sylveon, anything at all. Ay, ay, ay. I mean, this is not on, ending. I don't even know we need to talk about them because we know exactly how they're going. You, we've seen uh, Solar Blade collapse. Yeah, bro, and you're going to snipe this one. Let's go for it. Oh, that was <laughs> one Dragon Breath for Gyarados to take down two targets at once. Two parts of the three piece that OG was just able to put together. And now with 15 seconds of total, the Rayquaza spawns. Obviously, G with a gigantic advantage. And we almost... Well, I guess G... Uh, okay, right, Rayquaza, guys. Rayquaza. Are they going to just burst it down? They might just burst it down. 
OG yeah. really making the lore happen here in our group stage. Bones. Uh, I like that. They're, they're kind of sitting there Bones. with the Gyarados. They're just chilling, waiting to see if there's a target to Bow bounce oh. on. Oh, Blazik in with the eject button and cross the wall. I don't think there's anything in there. Any other way. Yeah, even then, good chance they won't be able to. Uh, but they've got to find a great initiation. They've got to find a great slow beam. I think if there's any way they're going to do it, it's going to be a great slow beam. A really but who can they even anger. slow beam? Like, uh, Leafeon, I guess. Does it really matter if Leafeon goes down here? Slash is going very aggressive. Oh, wait. Vegeletti is in too. What was that? Genuinely, what was that? Just separating the team. I mean, Umber just just kind of getting 42 points in. But they can't even well, do right. They're going to die here. They have no unite. They have only two unite moves left. They get raid. They get raid. They get raid. Only two members who earn the raid shields, and Charles is already gone. Dragon immediately. They win, guys. They're only down six. Hundred points. Uh, <laughs> they only down 600, but they got Ray. See, that was one of the biggest storms I've ever seen.